All right, a firewall. Um, now this weird illustration is to kind of explain the concept of ports, if you're not familiar with it. Um, so on every computer, you have 6, 65,535 ports, as they call it. So you say, oh, we've got port 80 or port 443 or port 8060. What that is, is basically, you can imagine it as a set of pipes that are basically connected together. They don't, so one pipe does not connect to the other. They're just one long pipe that cannot connect to another, another pipe next to them, but they're all tied together. And basically I can drop a ball on the end of one pipe and it goes down and comes out on the other end. Now, each of these pipes are numbered from zero to 65, five, three, four. And so you can assign each of these ports. You can say, okay, I, ex I want to listen to this port. So anything coming on this port, I want to receive it or I want to send something through this port. So in general, firewalls, now this is standard setting, firewalls are allowed, uh, computers are allowed to send anything they want from any port. So that's usually the setting you have. So outbound ports are always open. So if Tableau wants to connect to the outside internet, outbound port is always open. They can always send whatever they want. But the firewall usually blocks what you receive because, well, sometimes someone is sending you a nice, uh, candy on the end of one pipe and you do want to receive that. So yeah, you open that port so you know who's going to send it in which port, which pipe and you receive it. But let's say someone wants to send you a virus for instance and you don't want to receive that. So you don't want to keep all your ports open so that people can send anything they want. Rather, you want to keep it restricted to the few ports that you can control, you can filter, you can use your virus scanning procedures to scan it whatever. So you want to limit those ports. So in general, Tableau server has a certain port requirement, which we'll look at later when we're installing the server. And you need to make sure your firewall allows for this. And if not, contact your IT team, contact to, contact whoever is responsible for that uh, to open the correct ports. Because Tableau server does not attempt to open your firewall for you. Uh, an older version of Tableau Server used to, but since then they found, well, it runs into a lot of complications. Sometimes it doesn't work for necessary cases. And also, even if you open the firewall on the machine, sometimes there's a firewall further upstream that no one knew about that just blocks all this traffic anyways. So it is just best to have this firewall discussion with your IT team, have them open the correct ports for Tableau, which we'll discuss further again.